Alright guys, just got off work and just finished my school semester, so yeah, super pumped with that, finished four exams in these last two weeks, so these last two weeks have honestly been really just, mostly just stressful because like, if you guys know this, if you've ever experienced studying for exams, it's just a really stressful, not really a fun time, but other than that, like I'm just super happy and grateful that it's just done and over with, don't have to worry about that for the next coming months because it is summer kind of break. Yeah, to celebrate, I got something really, really special. So let me just grab it from my bag. If I can find it. All right, here we go. So my store is like the only store like in this area, Maple Ridge, that actually sells bangs. And so like bangs, you can't really find them anywhere like in this area. And so like my store sells them, but they're like, like six. No, not six. With my discount, they're like four bucks, which still for an energy drink is quite expensive. So that's why I don't normally buy them. And I've had them once before. If you guys watched a couple videos ago, I tried the sour apple one and honestly, I wasn't a fan. Like compared to the green monster and the um, sour apple rain, compared to those, it wasn't like good at all really. But um, yeah, bangs, I think they're like in terms of like what's in them, they're pretty similar to like a monster and like a rain. They also got some BCAA, so they got the leucine, isoleucine and valine, which is a nice little pre-workout slash entry workouts beverage so yeah we're gonna crack her open this is the frosé rosé flavor so this the color just kind of appealed to me and like kind of took my attention so that's kind of why we went for it so it should be a strawberry flavor and so my instagram buddy who i talk to often his name is rodney owens and he lives in the states too and he's just been just talking constantly about bang so rodney if you're watching this this better not let me down so smells promising off to a good start. You know what? That's quite nice. It's actually good, man. I've never had anything like this before. It's good. Like, no, I I'm, I'll take it, man. I'll give this like a 7.6 out of 10. It's up there, man. Like, it's amongst the top tier of energy drinks. I'll say that right now. Okay, wow. Awesome. Nice little treat to celebrate. But um, yeah, anyway, let's go to the gym now and let's smash our arms. Let's go. So we just made it to the gym and I've actually dropped my rating from a 7.5 to a 5 out of 10 because I don't know just something about it the aftertaste and just the flavor itself I guess I was just really excited when I first rated this but yeah 5 out of 10 All right, let's go train guys with a quick little post-workout meal right here so very simple just half a bag of lettuce some chicken breast and some fat-free Italian dressing so super hungry right now I'm gonna dig into this mm. We made it. So basically, in case you guys can tell, I'm on top of like a really big rock right now. And so you can basically see like the entire city from up here. 
Oh. Alright guys, so there's no actual reason why I'm up here other than it's pretty beautiful up here like the view is like incredible But anyway, I just wanted to quickly chat with you guys and just talk about a few things because some of my recent videos have been pretty Dramatic I guess you could say like oh I switched my coach and then oh I'm not competing at summer shredding anymore And then my gym closed and then all these kind of stuff have happened and so I don't want to make this video like super dramatic either But I mean <laughs> something has come up again and it sucks so Anyway, these past two weeks, again, as I mentioned before, have been pretty stressful for me in terms of like balancing school with like my full-time job, fitness, YouTube, social media, and just everything else going on, right? And so yeah, today was obviously like my last day of finals. Started off pretty stressful, but then once we finished, I was just super happy, super excited. And then like a couple hours later, I found out news that the show I was planning on doing, the WNBF in Kelowna, got postponed again to October. And it's just so frustrating because it seems like any show I wanna do, like I'll pick that show and then it'll get postponed or it'll get canceled because of this whole stupid situation and so everything is just so up in the air right now and it's like I even like there's still a couple shows available I can choose within like the same time frame but still even if I were to like 100% completely focus towards that show like I wouldn't be surprised if it got canceled or postponed as well it's like everything is just so unpredictable right now and this is honestly the worst time for me to like consider competing because again just especially like here like where I live everything is just so inconsistent unreliable again just so up in the air so it's just really frustrating like I'm not mad I'm not upset it's just ugh, you know I'm just really like I don't know what to do and so anyway the plan moving forward is that still gonna prep still gonna diet still gonna do my cardio still gonna train extremely hard still just gonna stay on top of everything but um, yeah, I just gotta find a new show again, and it's just really <laughs> annoying. Because like, I keep telling you guys, oh yeah, I was gonna do summer shredding, but then, oh no, the borders are closed, I can't go. And then, oh, I'm gonna do this WNBF show, and then, oh no, they postponed the show until October. And then, now I'm like, what should I do, you know? So, yeah, really just, yeah, I'm kind of repeating myself now, but again, it's just really frustrating and annoying. So, I mean, I know for a fact that I'm gonna go through this and like, I am like 100% no doubt I am going to find a show. I don't know which show it'll be and I don't know exactly when. Ideally like mid to late June, which is like the date I'm looking for. And so I know there's still a couple shows left out there and I'm just gonna keep dieting, keep prepping, keep doing what I've been doing these past couple of months. And yeah, just keep my fingers crossed that a show will happen. And so yeah, that's basically it. So again guys, is this ideal? Absolutely not, far from it actually. Will we keep going though? Yes, we absolutely will. So, with that said, I'm gonna keep my fingers crossed and I'm gonna end this video right here. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to go give this video a thumbs up. I'd highly appreciate it. Subscribe to my channel if you're new and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.